and let's see what happens because the bottom line is we are winning here let's win yeah it's not just... even about how you look like yeah. you can be green or be zebra striped or yeah. looking like a leopard yeah. see, at the end of the day <laughs> what are we doing we are in sports yes. to win hello family mula Dop here having my guest again we are focusing on um Fans are crying with the financial muscle of uh, PSL where we saw my and Sundowns are spending too much. Even every window period and uh, beginning of the season, they're spending more money. If you still remember last season, they spent around 100, what, 100 million. Eh? Yes. yes, they spent yes. around 100 million uh, rand. And uh, this season, they already uh, spent uh, approximately 50 million rand. And then many people are also are crying about uh, this, and many fans actually. So, how can you elaborate uh, this? A situation do you think it's it's, it's fair for medicine down to spend more than other clubs on the psl they're supposed to implement a uh, fair use like other um leagues in england yes um you know this is what i think yes right i think it must be made natural normal that um whoever wants to however i want one wants to live their life must be allowed you see because first of all the fans must understand what what they are gaining that's yes. fans what they what they are profiting from this whole expenditure or how money is moved around yes yes so sundowns uh there is this other one we, we just saw uh maseko guy yeah, they yeah, spent yeah. like 20 million yes and then there was a somebody actually voicing their own yes uh issues like uh, this is unfair yeah. spending like this or somebody spent 100 million last year yeah. you must understand we're working with brandy and we are trying to fix a car <laughs> we don't want it to be broken anywhere down yeah. the road so yeah. my son is what they are doing they are taking precautions yes they are trying to get the best vehicle yes they can money can buy yeah. you see what i'm saying yes so uh i don't think people should really fuss much about that Mm. they must look at the end product what's the bottom line mm. the bottom line we want a team that wins because yes. this is competition yes we are here to win yeah we are here to entertain we need the best actors yes we need the best acrobats uh athletics we want gymnasts yes best soccer players yes you understand mm. fill up the stadium on your tv screens on your laptops at the end of the day sandals is trying to also pay back yeah its supporters by giving them the point, best they can point, add, point. you see they can give you know what i'm saying so they'll put throw any money at any product that is good of good quality this shouldn't be really a concern it's just like when an individual say no i have this much cash and for my feet mm -hmm. i want to put this kind of a sneaker for my feet i love my feet because they, true. you understand they are, they, love it themselves yes they are my base i want to put these sneakers and they're comfortable spend as as much money as you can to keep this body up you understand yes it, it, it's all about the they really is just simple it's just simple it's just simple. so you don't uh you don't um voice that um a rule of implementing uh, the of financially uh, muscle um fair on, on, on psl yeah no uh i don't think there should be limits <laughs> you see yeah we 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 don't want to actually we love sandals yes. i love sandals so yeah. much i love uh soccer yeah. i love sports i love so many things you yeah. know um i love sundowns they have more money yeah and they want to spend it yes they want to also empower the players let yeah. me pay this man yeah. this man so much because there is a family behind him that yeah. he's feeding yes you see what i'm saying yes um i put him in here to do the job yes you see what i'm yes. saying i challenge him yes let me pay him overpay him <laughs> and see if he can pay that back yes and you must understand that indirectly so the supporter also gains something entertainment that's what the supporters are here for they want to support a company that is winning you understand they invested their emotions and time and money into this yes those uh no one is actually talking about it i watch tv i watch no one really want to get into that mm. but actually it's here the supporters are also putting money into teams yes because you know buying your own data and following these people and yeah. saying this that you have said that's your money that's your children's money you can take that money use it to buy something else but now you are here 
supporting your then time. Your team is not winning, <laughs> and then you come also saying that financial muscle. <laughs> What if your team is not winning because they were spending too much money? You feel me? Buying good players. Yes. So it's 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 so clear as we say it that um they are spending because they want their team to win. Yes. Clear is that it's very clear. We get the best engine we can get to move this vehicle. You see what I'm saying? Sanders must be encouraged to spend money as much as they want. <laughs> we should be behind those guys. Yes. You see, they, are, they are doing great, man. So they are even encouraging other clubs to spend money. Yes. Not only think for their stomach, you, stomach only. You understand? Only Black, for, the fa yes. for the fans. It's, it's, it's also important yeah. to spend money for fans. Yes. Black people, we should do it. I mean, because if, if, you give, uh, if you go down to this, um, I mean, imagine. Sundowns, the money they are spending is not even the league is how much is I think it's 17 18 million. It's too league. small. They are making around four if they uh, they take all the uh, trophies. I think uh, they're making around 40 million and they spend 100 million. Yes, you know what? Uh, uh, if you look at it, eh, yeah. if it is a sponsorship, model, uh, for an example, yeah. sponsorships most of them are white, white companies. You know, they come in and they invest their money here, they want to advertise their products because. As teams and their soccer players are actually uh, uh, what the life billboards. Yes, you understand. Yeah. So these white people are not scared of spending anything, and no other person is saying no. You can't do that. Now here is a black-owned team, mm. and it's a black brother mm. at the top, yes. con controlling, yeah. and he's saying, "Oh no, I have this money. Let me put in to create more black millionaires. This is black empowerment." Just this one is not coming directly from BEE, mm -hmm. it's coming the, from another direction. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure exactly, mm -hmm. what's, I, I won't dwell in that. Mm -hmm. But what I'm, I'm proud of uh, uh, the Montepe family, mm -hmm. Petrus Montepe, what he's doing. Mm -hmm. uh, Mayama Seko is still a very, very young boy. Mm -hmm. Imagine, man, the young man at, the, at that age, yeah, he's a yeah. billionaire in South Africa. That is a South African dream, you know? Yes. Um, many, many people must come out and do that. You understand because white people they don't see the problem uh, empowering their very own yeah you know true true I and you must be also be able to compete abroad with the salary not just a uh, soccer mm -hmm. um uh, our facilities yeah. and the prowess mm -hmm. we, we should be able to also say no i have this player and he's not hungry <laughs> he's gonna play in europe and he didn't just eat cotta yeah. you know <laughs> he actually he has they can buy sushi or something <laughs> or oh, look at his car Yes. You understand? Yes. It's not a 1988 Corolla model. Yeah. This guy can still be cruising down the street in in a nice, you know, modern uh, goods. Uh, maybe a salon car mm -hmm. that is actually safe, even to keep him safe on the road. This guy can afford that kind of car because he's a public figure. We still need him here. He's a role model to so many kids. Mm -hmm. He must look the part. Yes. So let's pay him. You see, I think it's everything is clear right now. Uh, without wasting time, let's just dive into the uh, Kaiser Chiefs. Uh, uh, leaked, it's, it's, a, it's a leaked kit, but it's a rumor again. You get oh. it? Uh, you saw it actually, it was uh, this one, uh, the gold one in black, and then there was a green one. You still remember? Oh, yeah. So, what do you say about because people are uh, fans of Kaiser Chiefs, they are complaining about in, about uh, the new kit, which is leaked, or also uh, named to be a rumor. It's not confirmed, but it's a, it's a rumor. rumor. Okay, is the same? Is the is actually still the same argument? Yes. Kara chiefs are only pushing the envelope here. You understand? Yeah. Sandals might might have spent money on uh, players. Yeah. Kara chiefs they are trying to make something as diff do something as differently. Okay, let's get that color. Let's get. We are just. Uh, this is trial and error. We are just experimenting on this, mm. and we have a big sponsor behind us. Mm. People love color. Kaya Chiefs are not scared of taking those risks. Mm. Let's put it, they were having a blue one mm. at some point. Yeah. Yes, and uh, it, it, it's just dark blue. Mm. Yeah. And people were like, ooh, we don't like this, but as time went, they started to love it. <laughs> you understand? <laughs> yes. Even this one, it like, look like I'm a bobo bobo, yeah. but they will love it eventually. <laughs> you know, yeah, we, we will grow into it. Yes. We're going to get used to it, and it will be beautiful. Because Kaya Chiefs, at the end of the day, they are also doing branding. Yes. You see, when you, when you do branding, you, you, it you mix new. so many things. Yes. You see what I'm saying? Let's it's put tea and coffee together and see yeah. what you can get. Yes. We might get coffee matcha yeah. or whatever. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's, it's business. You understand? Yeah. I mean, there is a market for nipple rings and yeah. you understand? Yeah. Somebody can also just come around and sell chicken ice. Mm. Let's go the ice it, out it, and it, sell it, them. It's, <laughs> it's business. It's what, it's, what it, it's what it is. You know what I'm saying? I, I applaud Kaiser Chiefs and yeah. all these other 
Pirates also is gonna, is gonna come up with something. Some people might not like it, but at the end of the day, the bottom line is we are branding this. Yeah, because last time uh, fans of Kansas City they were laughing at Orlando Pirates new jersey, which have what like a uh, matabo. Yeah, I like, saw. Ah! That. No, it was nice. Yeah, <laughs> it was funny. You know, you mustn't lose your sense of humor. You know, we can dress a man. No, my tumble is yeah. like it. No, but sometimes you know you need a just a little spatula of uh, sense of humor into the whole thing. You know what I'm saying? Just yes. tear things up. You must understand these bosses. They come in and they meet the marketers and they meet the PRs and everyone. Yeah. Yeah. And now, actually, the bottom line is to shake up the system. Yes, true. To entertain as much as we can. It's entertainment. The bones on a. Uh, a, a uniform mm. it, it kind of give you another perspective you kind of think about it and say hey what are we doing here you understand <laughs> why well, these are the real these are real bacanias man they, <laughs> they, 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 they are here to kill someone somebody gotta be buried yes, yes, there's about, a story behind of those, you feel me those bones there is you know some people sat down and work on it mm, true you know it's just it's so unfortunate that these guys cannot go out to house to house and check with the fans first yeah and see him and what do you think of <laughs> it's, that is the only unfortunate uh, point you yeah, know what i'm saying yeah. but if it was possible trust me they were gonna do because i know that these teams respect the fans yes true uh, teams in south africa refer, respect the fans and I, I i've seen it a couple of times you know they will actually even make appearances on tv yes, shows yes. on podcasts yes you know find bobby mutown they find mm. mr Ivan Kosa, the great man yeah. and mr mozepe they're smiling yeah. you know yeah. they, they come to the pitch they sit on you look at even european teams you don't always find the owner of the team sitting somewhere in the vip yeah area. true but here you'll see Kizam, dr kazam town sitting there Jomo Son used to be on the touchline, yeah. coaching. Yeah, you are like, do this. You are trying to teach, give something to uh, South African team owners. They take their supporters serious. Let, let's not get it twisted. Yes, you understand. Yes. I respect these guys. Um, kind of cheese they must go ahead with the leaked jersey yeah. and let's see what happens because the bottom line is we are winning here let's win yeah it's not even about how you look like yeah. you can be green or be zebra striped or yeah. looking like a leopard yeah. <laughs> at the end of the day <laughs> what are we doing we are in sports yes to win the jazz doesn't win the match uh, no just let these guys spend money as much as they can to give you as the best entertainment they can you see what i'm saying yes so it's still the same argument the metro effect i i think yeah, this is it for the day i really appreciate your words mm -hmm. uh, guys don't forget to subscribe don't forget to subscribe and also join the membership if you're willing to